Aries, hi, I'm doing a love reading now. This is for Sun, Moon and Rising Aries. If you are returning to my channel, welcome back. If you are new, welcome and thank you for stopping by. Coral Tree Tarot here. These are timeless and general love tarot readings. They are not going to resonate with everyone, so only take what resonates. Aries. actually want to begin with some of the oracles here so we're almost ready I'll start with some handwritten messages and we'll we will see Aries show me spirit the one that resonates with okay we've got two I am checking your social media Will you marry me? Okay, someone is very interested in you, Aries. Um, this is a very bold question. So, someone is very interested in you, Scorp uh, excuse me, Scorpio, Aries, perhaps it's Scorpio. Aries, let's see what's happening for Aries. humid where I am and the deck is really sticky to death Queen of Cups this is Scorpio you could be dealing with Scorpio and four of Pentacles um, something is undergoing humongous humongous transformation something or someone I should say this is a very strong Scorpio energy these two but also um, it really talks about a huge shift and transformation and change um, I feel you may not be aware that this is happening for this person for your person someone's here literally undergoing under, uh, undergoing metamorphosis and it is all connected with the love that this person has for you because of the queen of cups in the past this person has fallen in love and this love is you know perpetuating this it, it's like a fuel for this person's change it's something big changing here about this person and as I say, I don't think this person is giving a lot of hints about this because of the Four of Pentacles. And we have the star going into the future, which is a very beautiful energy. Um, wish fulfillment. Tell me more about the change. Tell me more about this transformation. Look, the sun. Beautiful energy. Beautiful energy. King of Swords. And Ace of Cups. Beautiful energy. Someone has been literally... It's like this love has lighted up this person the love that they have for you the love that you share it has just you know brought meaning to this person's life the sun is the most positive and protective and powerful energy in tarot deck in the presence of difficult energies, it always mm, softens the, the difficult energy. So this is, you know, 
every time it, 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 I'm not sure how well you know tarot, death, it's far from you know simplicity here. It is, it's not an easy energy. Meaning this is not over. It doesn't, you know, only talk about endings and deaths, etc. This is a transformation. This person, I feel, has clarity. What this loves, what this love, connection, what you mean to them. It's sitting right next to the love, you know, Ace of Cups energy. This is love as well. So I feel, I feel you may have no idea what's going on in this person's heart and head. This is head, this King of Swords. Um, and having this, this, this clearly tells me that this person's not letting uh, a lot, not this playing all what is happening in their heart and head. And there is a lot of happening. And it is because of the love, connection, of the love they feel for you, of the relationship. I wonder why, why is the Four of Pentacles? But I'm not going to clarify. There's always a reason. Someone's, you know... I feel there is, you know, for... There is, there is a change. Your person is undergoing literally metamorphosis, literally change. It's like from a moth... Um, no, from a moth... Not from a moth, from an egg to a butterfly, okay? And that's fueled with beautiful, beautiful feelings here, love. They are checking your social media. I have a feeling for some of you, um, this is someone new. And perhaps that's why we have the Four of Wands, the Four of Pentacles. I was focusing on tarot. Um, for me, this star, it, it's literally this statement here. I feel this person has long-term intentions for this connection. Um, I feel that they are very hopeful. Um, they are deeply touched and this it could be Scorpio, Aquarius as well, Leo, but um, it could be Scorpio. It doesn't have to be Aquarius as well, Leo too. Um, very, very beautiful energy, Aries. I have Chariot here. I feel this person definitely want progress in this connection. We've got this page of swords, which is this energy of I'm checking your social media. They are a little bit stressed. They will they will be a little bit stressed because this is big time love that changes your life. That's why they will be stressed. This is checking social media, this page of sorts. Um, they definitely want progress. There is there is distress about this, like how do I... The chariot for me, it's such a, you know, fantastic energy because it shows that someone's got a goal and they are going to go for it. This is Major Arcana. This is this is just simple stress, being overwhelmed with with what is happening to them, and this is happening to them. They are they are changing big time. Let me know. But that's what I'm getting here. So I feel this is actually rather new because of the 
page of swords and checking your social media i feel that you 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 have an established relationship where you communicate on daily basis you know freely comfortably um but that will will you marry me message clearly um to me feels like this person has long term intentions for this situation aries Hand of cards, take a chance. Paradise. Take a chance, risk being strategic. Options, not showing hand, gambling. Take a chance. I feel this four of pentacles here. They are... I don't think you, you are aware of um, how, you know, deeply this person is in love with you and how deeply this person is being affected um, by this uh, uh, love, you know, connection. Happiness, expansion, joy, enjoying each other paradise it feels very positive it feels you know um this is the star it feels very hopeful this person feels hopeful because they fell in love this is pure love pure emotion So in terms of future, this person does want a progress, but maybe a little bit stressed. This is definitely wanting progress. Um, so apply it to your situation again. If this is someone new, I would expect that you know this person will reach out, will ask you out, will start dating you in a you know um, exclusive way, etc. Because this is progress. This, this person is completely in love. Like, they are not looking at anybody else. I feel you with me. Aries. You could be dealing with German, right? What? We have quite a few. Uh, Mercury, 11th house, opposition. You could be dealing with Gemini. Mercury, thoughts, communication, intellect, Gemini, Virgo. Um, communication, this four of pentacles is the only thing that I would like to see shifting in this situation. Um, this oracle is called thoughts because Mercury as a planet, you know, it symbolizes communication, thoughts, intellects, um, memory, information, research, education, yes. For me, this is communication. I just hope, um, and yes, it's checking of social media. I would like to see this progress in in terms of re establishing excuse me establishing of a um, communication like how, how can you progress think if you do not start communicating 11th house in astrology deals with friends friends social circle community um for some of you you may have met recently at a you know, christmas party business your your work business party or you could have been simply introduced by a friend to this person somehow community friends play a role here and opposition this is the name of an aspect in astrology as the oracle is called i mean it's called confrontation because it is not an easy aspect um opposition Seeking balance, tests, internal conflict, respect, and acknowledgement. Um, I feel that 
death card here, this transformation in itself, I feel this person is really... This person's life was flipped upside down, like literally, um, because of that love. And I feel this is that confrontation that someone's going through here. Um, you know, in a presence of some real emotions, we need to act. There's some communication that needs to happen. And there is a beautiful hope that this person is, is you know, seeing for this connection here with the star. Aries, um, thank you for your time. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this reading, don't forget to like and subscribe. And I do appreciate all your likes. They do um, let me know that you have enjoyed this content. You like the way I do the reading. So if you've watched the video and you enjoyed it, please smash the like button. I really, really appreciate that. Do subscribe to my channel. It helps me to build this channel. Um, that's all that I have for you today, Aries. All the very best. And I'll speak to you some goodbye for now.